everybody! I'm here today with a simple driving lesson on what to do if your turns are too wide. That's right, many people go through this. Their turns are too wide. And I'm going to tell you what to do in this simple driving lesson. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. Now, you're probably turning too wide because you're afraid of hitting the curb or scraping something. And that's completely normal. That is an absolutely normal fear. But I'm going to tell you five simple things that you can do to hopefully help correct that. So. Uh, the first thing is to turn the wheel a bit more. Let's say that I was going to turn and I was going to turn the wheel like this, but my turns are usually too wide. Give the wheel a bit more juice, as I like to call it. Turn the wheel a bit more. So as you can see, let's say I'm turning down this street right here and I usually turn the wheel like this, but my turns are too wide. Give the wheel a bit more turning, turning, turniture. I was going to say that doesn't even make any sense. It's not even a real word. Give the wheel a bit more juice. So turn the wheel a bit more. That's uh, definitely the first thing. Um, and probably the main thing that you're going to be able to do to correct it. Okay. Um, the second thing is to start turning. Come on, man. What are you doing? Sorry. The first just decides to stop in the middle of the road. Anyways, uh, the second thing is going to be to start turning the wheel a bit earlier. So if your turns are too wide, maybe you're turning the wheel the right amount, but you're starting to turn the wheel a little too late. That's very possible. So let's say I would usually turn the wheel um, in about a second. I'm going to start turning it a bit earlier, okay? That's going to help you sharpen your turns. So by starting the wheel turning process just a little bit early, it's going to really help you to uh, make your turns not as wide. Oh my gosh. We Buddy, watch my videos on how to drive, bro. Oh my goodness. These people are just, just, just disasters. Oh, no way. There's no way. Three times. People cut me off three times in within the first couple minutes of a video, bro. What are you doing? Go watch some of my tutorials, please. Anyways, back to business. Sorry about that. That was just unbelievable. Um, turn the wheel a bit earlier. That's the second thing, okay? And that's the key factor right there. Um, also, the third thing that you can do, I'm going to just stop for one second over here. The third thing that you can do is look a bit further to the side. Now, where you look will determine uh, where you're going to go. So if I'm driving right here and I'm turning too wide, but when I turn left, I'm looking right here. That's why my turns are too wide. I got to look over here, right? So you want to adjust your viewing point. If you don't find yourself looking basically at a 45 degree angle on either side, then you're not looking uh, far enough to the side. So for instance, if I'm making a right turn, I'm looking directly at that pillar over there in this corner of the windshield. If I'm making a left turn, I'm looking over here basically, okay, in that direction, right? If I'm making a left and I just look over here, that's why my turns are too wide because I'm looking where I want the car to go. You got to look exactly where you want the car to go. Um, step number four, the fourth thing that you can do if your turns are too wide is practice in an empty parking lot. That's where I am right now. I'm in an empty parking lot. So just go and practice. Literally drive. I want you to make 100 left turns and 100 right turns. Literally. And if you make those turns, you're going to keep getting better and better and better. Like, look, I just made a left right there. I'm going to go make another left over here. Just keep going over and over and over again. Another left again. Keep doing that. The more that you practice, the better off that you're going to be. Like if you do 100 left turns and 100 right turns, there's no way you're not going to improve. It's that simple. Last but not least is the fifth thing that you can do, and that's do not look at what you are afraid of hitting. So if you're afraid of hitting the curb, let's say my turns are too wide, my right turns are too wide. Okay, I'm going to go close to a pole here, okay? Let's say I'm making a right and I'm turning too wide because I'm afraid of hitting the pole. Well, if I look at that pole, guess what? I'm going right into the pole, okay? So if you're afraid of hitting the curb, don't look at the curb. Because if you look at the curb, then guess what? You're going to hit You're gonna hit the curb. Your fears are going to come true. So it's literally as simple as that. You want to make sure that you don't look at whatever it is that you're afraid of hitting or scraping. It's as simple as that. And that's basically it. Sorry, just got to stretch my back there. And that's basically it. In this video, I've shown you and told you what to do when your turns are too wide. It's been a simple driving lesson, and I really hope that you've enjoyed it. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great cars and driving videos just like this one and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching